back to West Wild World and welcome back to Snake Shit Sunday. Um, I don't think I explained it in any of the other videos what Snake Shit Sunday actually is. Um, so basically Snake Shit Sunday is just going to be me going through doing all the normal stuff I do that I don't usually film like taking out and socializing my snakes and things like that. Any cleaning that I have to do on the weekend. Um, so just things like that. So it's going to be more of a chill video, probably just um, time lapses or sped up versions of me handling this with some music and some quick facts about the things. So yeah, I'm going to take out my green mamba because I do need to clean and I do want to socialize it a bit. So I'm going to hop into it and I'll get to you guys when I have a look. I've been sinking on a ship, right? Really wish I was an airhead. Stay afloat with no care in the world. Life jagged on my bare chest. Sadly, I can't be the guy that you dream about. Angry sailor, gotta go let the steam out. And I wish it was easy. Drowning in sea, cause my baby keep leaving. Mad as can be at the way that it happened. So, this is my Eastern Green Mamba. Quite warm and irritated today, so I don't think I'm gonna be free handling it. Um, but we'll see how it goes when it calms down a bit. But yeah, um, as you can see, when you don't socialize your animals that much with your handling, they do get a bit temperamental and they do get a bit scared when you do handle them. And that's why I prefer to try and socialize my animals as much as possible um, so they don't get so stressed out when I take them out every time to clean them. So yeah, I'm just gonna handle it. Handle her a bit and then I'll get back to you guys. I've been sinking on a ship, right? Really wish I was an airhead. Stay afloat with no care in the world. Life jagged on my bare chest. Sadly, I can't be the guy that you dream about. Angry sailor, gotta go let the steam out. And I wish it was easy, drowning in sea cause my baby keep leaving Mad as can be at the way that it happened I'm in in the ship but don't call me no captain Cause I can't control anything going manic Eyes looking blue, I end up like Titanic Throwing myself overboard in a panic I'm walking a plane when I'm off of the brandy Sign off the sea, never thought I would vanish Now I'm on a trip to the core of the planet to bring my bike but still got the ocean sounds i'm trying to be there for you i'm too hard on myself what hurts me the most is you keep coming back feel like you like when i'm caught in your trap oh darling i'm too obsessed with you i'm a psychopath cause i'm protecting you what well, have you done for me besides nothing at all wish i had the strength to leave but i'll come when you call when you call and leave my on the hilltop and fed me with lies and waste of time now we still go. Still short of me and you still keep it in my room But where I lay when you're going I'll throw it all away and never see your face again If you ever wanna see me know you'll have to play I've just taken the green mamba out, spent a little bit more time with it And I'm just gonna get it straight back into its enclosure For one of the most feared snakes in the world, you can see how calm they are. Obviously not the eastern greens, the black mums are one of the most feared. But if you handle them appropriately, they can be just as calm as your normal corn snake. Awesome animal. Okay, so I've just put the green mamba back after handling it for a bit and cleaning up its enclosure, giving it some more water, spraying its enclosure down. I'm going to take the rent cost out to put it in this black bin because they haven't been doing so well in the display cages. They like to be enclosed, but yeah, I'm just going to get them out and handle them for a bit to socialize them and yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. Okay, 
Johannesburg. So this is my Johannesburg locality. They come in a bunch of different colors. And yeah, <laughs> they're also very flighty. They have a potent cytotoxic venom, but obviously it's not that bad and it is covered by our polyvalent anti-venom down here in South Africa. But it's also definitely not a bite that I would want to take. And you can see how flighty these guys are, hard to touch and even to taking me with the hook. But yeah, this is why socializing these guys are a bit important to me. Um, also, after handling, they sort of refuse food for a while. So I want to get them used to handling and not to get so stressed out. So this is why I do these things. Um, not to look cool, not to do anything like that, but yeah, just to get my animals used to my touch. I'll throw it all away and never see your face again. If you ever want to see me know, you'll have to play pretend. I'll throw it all away and never see your face again. I come back from the dead, I will never make amends with you Spend time on the rocks, when you leave town Forgot to bring my bike, but still got the ocean sounds I'm trying to be there for you, I'm too hard on myself What hurts me the most is you keep coming back Feel like you like when I'm caught in your trap Oh darling, I'm too obsessed with you I'm a psychopath, cause I'm protecting you Nothing at all Wish I had the strength to leave But I'll come when you call When you call And leave my house on the hilltop And fed me with lies And waste the time that we still got Still short of me and you Still keep it in my room But where I lay when you're gone I'll throw it all away And never see your face again If you ever wanna see me Know you'll have to play pretend I'll Throw it all away and never see your face again If I come back from the dead, I will never make amends with you Let's see how they calm down in your hands Awesome snakes, but I'll get the other one out real quick And I'll get back to you guys soon We're all nice and calm my black run cost was now it's time to get out the banded one who absolutely hates life and loves to spit at me every single chance it gets um but yeah the more and more i handle this snake obviously the more it's going to calm down both of me some snakes ugh, don't ever calm down and that's just their personality but I'm going to try my best to get this guy to calm down. is a lot more touchy than the other one as you guys can see so i do have to be a lot more careful with them but yeah any snake will calm down eventually it just depends on the way that you handle them obviously some don't calm down at all and that's just their personality is that they are very very defensive like this and i don't want you guys to ever think that these guys are aggressive in any sort of sense i'm going into his space i'm irritating him if he was left alone he would not be acting like this but yeah every single snake has their own unique personality when it comes to how defensive they are and how they act very sim similar to that of people so some snakes just act like this um and others are very very laid back like the black one you saw but you can see how He's more so concentrated on movement like most of leopards. He is, he's not part of the true cobra family. He's in his own genus, even though he has very similar characteristics to that of a cobra. But I hope you guys enjoy. Hopefully I don't get a tag from him because he is very touchy. Let's see. Okay, so as you guys can see, he's still being very defensive, but he's just locked onto the camera at the moment. 
So even snakes that are very, very defensive or even aggressive do calm down eventually. Obviously he's still standing his ground, but he's not trying to come back at me there. He's focused on me a little bit. But you can see how beautiful this guy is. I'm just gonna get him straight into his enclosure. And there you go. So yeah, obviously when socializing my animals, um, I like to quote unquote free handle. I don't like to use equipment. I like them to get used to my touch and that's sort of how I like to socialize my personal animals. Yeah, but I'm just gonna, well, actually, I think it should be the end of the video here from this beautiful guy. Thank you guys so much for watching this Snake Shed Sunday and I'll be posting these types of videos every single Sunday. But I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.